That's it, the match has finished. Newcastle uh, United women six, Bradford City one. Superb performance from the team today, just what the doctor had ordered. Two goals from Beth Guy, two from Charlotte Potts, um, one from Georgia Gibson and a pen penalty from Rachel Lee. All round solid performance. Couldn't have asked for anything more today. Little bit disappointing conceding that um, kind of freak free kick in the second half there, but well done to the lasses. Congratulations. Won nothing yet. Onwards and upwards. Uh, I believe Durham won 2 0. And with Newcastle winning 6 1, Newcastle are still six points behind with two games in hand and are level on goal difference. For it. So it's in their hands to move forward uh, to win the last three games, bag plenty of goals in, and win this league and get promotion. So let's get some reaction from some of the players. Hi, Charlotte, congratulations. Now, I bummed into your, your mum and dad outside at the beginning of the game. What a chat. She said, Have you scored? You're going to get some tea later on? Some tea. You've scored two? You're getting a pudding? <laughs> Rice pudding. <laughs> <laughs> two goals, 6-1. Yeah. I think Durham won 2-0, so I think your level on goal difference, how are you feeling? Yeah, absolutely fantastic. I mean, we went into that game knew we needed to get the goal tally up. We used the advantage of the crowd, the advantage of the atmosphere. It's just fantastic that we're getting these opportunities and, like I say, we never take it for granted. Yeah. Haven't won anything yet, though. Long no, way to go. All. Not at all. One, one step at a time. Obviously, we got a little bit of a kick last week and I think it's knocked us back down to earth. And we've got back up and showed a reaction. And we just make sure we keep focusing on the process. Um, so, Tyneside Lives, uh, woman of the match today. Congratulations, Charlotte. Great performance, uh, personally, and a great all-round performance for the team. Spot on. Yeah, I thought that was, collectively as a team we were fantastic today. Georgia, congratulations. Um, personally, an all-round fantastic performance. Scored one, I don't know, it was two or three assists? Three, I think. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so... Personally, a really good game. Yeah, I'm really happy. And uh, how are the team feeling at the minute? Of course, you've won nothing. You know, there's a long way to go, but superb performance today. Yeah, obviously, there's a buzz inside the change room now. Everyone's really happy and delighted. Uh, you've got to appreciate the, uh, the opportunity we've got here to play, so you've got to enjoy it. And uh, Amanda, Murdad and Becky have been kind of big on that, that it's, we've got to enjoy playing. Um, and the results will come with it. We know there's three more games now away to play. Um, they are must-win games as well. Have Amanda and Murda just popped into the change room to have a few words? Yeah, they've just been in. Amanda's had a little dance. <laughs> uh, we've done the team photo, which they're in as well, which is fantastic. Um, yeah. Georgia, congratulations. Well done. <laughs> Thank you very much. Cheers. Beth, wow, congratulations. Uh, two goals as well. I mean, I don't know, are you the shortest player on the pitch? Two brilliant headers. Yeah, I think it's out of me and uh, KB, but no. Um, I was saying before, I think all my goals this season have been headers um, and it kind of works in my favour. I've been the, one of the littlest little on the pitch because players don't seem to pick us up or the tallest players don't seem to pick us up. So, yeah, I'm just delighted with the three points in there for all the girls that got on the score sheet, yeah. Solid performance and uh, it must have been a lot for your family as well, for the for personally the performance you've put in and getting two goals? Absolutely, yeah. Um, I think it, it, they are the reason why I play football. Um, there's, th th there is no two ways about it and it's just, you know, with... We've got an amazing group of girls, um, the 11 on the pitch, the girls on the bench, the girls not on the squad that have been with the development team today. I think everyone, you know, we all rally around each other and we all we all want to push each other. What did uh, Amanda say in the dressing room? Um, she was over the moon, she was delighted. Um, I think she is every single time she comes and watches play. Um, her dad was in there as well and they are, they're, they're just really proud and we, we wouldn't be where we are playing on this pitch without their ownership and without their um, backing. And I think that... That shows, you know, if you would have said a couple of years ago you'll be playing in front of 24,000 people at St James's Park, we all would have said, that's not happening. Um, but for this, the third time for it to be happening since they've took over, that's amazing. Beth, well done and congratulations on your two goals. Fab, thank you.